Imagine a world where robots look, think, and act like us. Welcome to China's $2,000 hyper-realistic marvels. From lifting patients with ease to lifelike companions, these game-changing machines blur the line between man and machine. They're smart, lifelike, and redefining innovation. Curious? Stick around to discover the tech shaking up our world. You won't believe what's next. White Rabbit White Rabbit, a Japanese company that makes female humanoid robots, has launched the newest generation of these machines which could completely replace women in the next few years. These robo-dolls are usually called A19 and are noted for their exquisite design and innovative materials, making them beloved by collectors and artists. The heads of the robots are made of tough silicone so that they have a realistic feel to them, as well as last longer. Hand-applied makeup distinguishes one model from another on each robot done by professional makeup artists. It is highly meticulous in terms of rendering natural facial features and body proportions. White Rabbit makes incredibly lifelike robots and is well known for its attention to detail as well as use of state-of-the-art technologies. Every single robot produced is put through rigid quality control mechanisms. On top of this, clients can make orders for tailor-made dolls with specific details like makeup styles, hairstyles, or dresses. Chinese Robotic Doll the Chinese are just amazing. They have recently unveiled the latest realistic robotic dolls that are now available for sale. These robots have artificial intelligence and are intended to be real companions for single men. The dolls look like human beings in every way possible, even at the smallest level. They are made from thermoplastic elastomer TPE, that makes them feel soft and elastic similar to human skin. The metallic skeleton inside the dolls allows them to take on various poses making them flexible and stable. However, these robots, although very lifelike, cannot fully substitute humans yet. Being unable to replicate emotional attachments, loving affection, or any dynamic human relationships is where they stand now. Whitney Cummings Whitney Cummings, the distinguished stand-up comedian, actress, and writer, has entered the field of robotics by creating Bear Claw, a robot version of herself. The project came up as a result of her interest in robots and their effect on society. In her live shows, Cummings usually talks about technology-related matters and human nature. Hence, she got interested in the study of robotics. She got inspiration for Bear Claw while touring a robot manufacturing plant so that she could get material for comedy. This was when she became fascinated with the idea that there could be an imitation of herself that not only looked like her, but also responded to jokes during her act. More than simply being unusual, Bear Claw is one way in which Cummings examines gender roles and women's struggles to balance both their personal and professional lives. Qingbao's Engine Robots of China China's Qingbao engine robots are a great improvement in human-like robot technology that reveals the country's determination to take the lead globally. Qingbao Engine Robotics was established on August 2022 and focuses on AI and humanoid robots research and development, with strong emphasis on practical applications in different industries. In the World Robot Conference for 2024, Qingbao presented various groundbreaking models, including a humanoid robot able to interact like a real person. The model has artificial skin allowing it to make natural facial expressions, as well as salutations. The functional purpose is not only sourcing out, but also enhancing human-robot interaction, which makes robots more friendly and efficient in service roles. Qingbao robots have sophisticated mobility systems and precise control, which enables them to do complex tasks effectively. On top of this, the Chinese government has set out some ambitious targets for the humanoid robot sector that seek mass production within less than 10 years by 2025 as part of its broader strategy aimed at driving economic growth through technological innovation. Akin Robotics ADA7 Akin Robotics is among the companies joining the trend of humanoid robotics. However, their products are still behind those of their competitors, but there are some promising improvements in sight. As an example, they made a whole line of social robots called ADA7. These robots are created for public places like museums, shopping centers, and offices. This latest version of the ADA series stands for a new era of user-serviceable communication and assistance robots. ADA7 can move autonomously for eight hours before it must be fully recharged within four hours since it is fitted with lithium-ion batteries that can be recharged. One remarkable character Characteristic about ADA7 is that it can get back to its dock by itself, making it more convenient. Apart from being multilingual with Turkish, English, Russian, Arabic, and German languages, among others, these bots can also easily be modified to embody worldwide use. Robotic Eye An outstanding innovation has been developed by a Japanese engineer, which is the robotic eye. This eye is spherical, and it resembles a human eye in terms of its natural reactions and movements. 
It is housed in a red and white spherical frame with actuator muscles, moving pupils, and integrated eyelids. The globe can blink or move in different directions like roll or turn in different positions so as to focus on specific points as if seeing. By having wires attached to it that act as connectors to the other parts of the machine, this particular device follows external power-driven guidelines for regulating motion, such as pursuing things that are moving or executing programmed sequences. Its major application lies in animatronics where it creates lifelike motion for robots, movie characters, and even park rides. Fourier GR2 Fourier Intelligence, a Chinese-based robotics company, has launched the second generation of humanoid robots known as GR2. The robot has an all-new body design, a detachable battery with twice the capacity and arms that look like humans comprising 12 degrees of freedom. The new GR2 model is taller and heavier than its predecessors. It is now 175 centimeters tall and weighs 63 kilograms, with each arm having a payload capacity of up to 3 kilograms. From 44 to 53 degrees of freedom have been added in total. As for the body construction, engineers re-implemented it. With this came changes in the panel design, together with integration of all existing cords within the machine. The GR2 has six touch sensors which can be used to identify object shapes and materials, as well as adjust its grip strength. In conclusion, we can see that many efforts have been made by these guys from China, and I am looking forward to more videos about their new creation. Weave Isaac Weave Robotics has announced their new humanoid robot, named Isaac, which is specifically designed to be used as a robotic assistant at home. There is no much information so far about this robot, but the manufacturer assures us that the revolution of home robotics technology is coming. We look forward to hearing more about this new development. Ricci, the humanoid robot developed by Pollen Robotics named Ricci, that knows how to play chess, gives humans an adversary made of robotic humanoid. The uniqueness of Ricci lies in its learning process. Initially, the human controlled the robot from afar using a virtual reality headset and showing it how to do various things. The machine learning algorithm then scrutinized around 50 video clips of these teleoperation sessions, each lasting about 15 seconds. With 40K to 60K training iterations under its belt, Ricci conquered complex action sequences. It learned to grab an apple on its own, rotate it smoothly in his hand before returning it back to his initial position, but above all, play chess. Therefore, as time goes by and additional tasks are given for practice, it will become increasingly complicated. Alter 3. University of Tokyo researchers with Osaka University have developed the latest humanoid robot called Alter 3. It is integrated with powerful GP4 AI model that enables it to perform intricate movement and replicate human behavior with simple oral instructions. Alter 3 can take a selfie or act as if it is a ghost on text commands, converted into code that could be immediately generated and executed. It has 43 degrees of freedom for accurate replication of the movements of its upper body. Some examples include facial expressions and gestures, showing emotions like surprise, joy, etc. By simulating walking or pretending to play music, this robot can do some dynamic things, even though its lower part remains stationary as it is fixed on a platform. Reba 2. The Riken Tri Collaboration Center for Human Interactive Robot Research has developed an advanced caregiving robot called Riba 2 to address the challenges of Japan's aging population. This next generation robot is designed specifically to lift patients from bed to wheelchair and can lift patients weighing up to 80 kilograms, considerably relieving one of the most strenuous tasks faced by caregivers. To crouch down and perform lifts effectively, Reba 2 features a higher power output and increased functionality compared with its predecessor, Reba. The first capacitive tactile sensors, made entirely of rubber and known as smart rubber sensors, are equipped on Reba 2. These sensors detect how much an individual weighs through touch, ensuring patient safety during transfers. The robot's design emphasizes highly precise tactility guidance and incorporates a soft exterior for maximum patient comfort. E-Foldi Explorer. The E-Foldi Explorer scooter is available for $3,520, providing a foldable and relatively light design. Without the battery, it only weighs 17 kilograms, which makes it quite easy to move around with. It has such flexibilities that make this electric vehicle stand out, because you can comfortably take it into a public transport, put it inside the car boot, or use as your chair. It may not be the fastest scooter on the market in terms of speed, reaching a maximum speed of just 13 kilometers per hour, but its range of 23 kilometers when fully charged more than compensates for this. The producers argue that this distance provides some sort of freedom, 
The ride is still smooth and comfortable with pneumatic tires and four-point seat suspension, making it ideal for everyday use. As such, whether one is commuting to work, running errands, or simply exploring their city, eFold eExplorer brings together practicality, comfort, and convenience in one small package. Transform is an incredible technological art piece that stunned audiences at 2014 Lexus Design Amazing Milan, as well as continues to surprise them with its originality and fluidity of motions. This amazing table alters data flow and energy. By using three animated screens made up of thousands of pins, it has unpredictable movements. These movements are driven by sensor-based kinetic capture of human presence, leading the transformation on the table to imitate components such as wind, water, or sand. Transform goes beyond a mere furniture. It stands for how nature may harmonize with machines. Its changing surface keeps viewers mindful of their relationships with each other all the time, whereas one can see both organic and mechanical pieces working together in an identical design, making it a timeless fine art mixed with science performance. Synhelion June 20 marked an incredible event in solar energy that nearly passed unobserved. This was a new era of Synhelion, as they launched their first industrial-scale plant in Germany for the production of synthetic fuels using concentrated solar heat. This could be a game-changer for the energy industry. As simple as it may sound, it is very effective. Concentrating mirrors focus sunlight on a receiver sitting atop the tower uniquely designed for it leading to high temperatures creation. Therefore, the synthesis gas produced from this process can then be used for making synthetic fuel using thermochemical reactors that are run by heat. For instance, today's volume is low with only few thousand liters per year. However, Synhalion is currently moving towards scaling up. It can saturate the market with solar fuel if successful and become one of major sources of renewable energy while reducing dependence on oil products. O2. Orbital Marine Power has taken a big step towards green energy by building the most powerful tidal turbine in the world, called O2. This structure is so gigantic that it delivers 2 megawatts of electricity, or enough to power about 2,000 houses. It was not an easy task to construct and launch O2. Its fan-shaped blades rotate around their axis in order to maximize the use of kinetic energy. This results in a total mass of 680 tons, which is quite heavy. This project marks a significant turning point toward environmentally friendly power use using constant strength of tidal currents to produce sustainable energy. Orbital marine power is illustrating how we can make life any more cleaner and greener. In 1995, Astrohaven Astronomical was founded by Grover Brotherton with a simple yet ambitious idea of building and selling inexpensive fiberglass domes for observatories. This exceptional product took off like wildfire, so he tried out some rotating models before introducing a fixed clamshell-shaped building. The demand for this was so high that at one point, they even had to build a 6-meter dome. Today, it caters not only to the hobbyist astronomers, but also defense contractors. Those domes have incorporated the state-of-the-art aerospace engineering solutions while still staying true to their original mission of Astrohaven, make users no longer think about maintenance issues and focus on astronomy or science, an evidence of innovations and dedication in a narrow specialization field. 